You are now rocking with Mr. Males, the Pro Money Geek General himself, mm, the PMG Drip Squad General in the building. All right, so now that we got the introductions out of the way, I want to let you know that you are in the right place at the right time during this hyperinflation season. All right, so right now, if you don't know, I'm going to introduce you to Drip Squad. Drip Squad. All right, and the platform we're looking to get into right now is the drip ecosystem, the drip community, as well as the animal farm. Unless you've been under a rock the last year or so, you've never heard of it, but more than likely you have. And if you've been on the fence of trying to decide whether or not to take advantage or jump in, then hey, by all means, hopefully I can swing you to that direction, you know, so you can see the benefit. Now, keep in mind, I am not a financial advisor. You know, this is not financial advice. I'm just giving my opinion. And if you see any benefit from the opinion that I project or that I share with you, feel free to take advantage of it just as I am. All right. Later on in this video, I'm going to show you a few positions that I currently hold. I'm a small fish in the big pond. Um, I wish I would have got in on the very first stint at launch or pre-launch but I did catch it right before the original V1 uh, Animal Farm launched. I threw a sizable bag in at that point, but as you all know, before the big pause, um, I had lost a couple of dollars on the capital side. So let's just say, for example, I started with 20,000. By the time I claimed my dogs for this V2 launch, I ended up with like 17,000. So I lost it three thousand uh, dollar surplus however during that one month that the v1 farm did launch i was able to accumulate um roughly 36 pigs which at the tight um, at the height of it um was about ten thousand dollars but like i said once i dropped from 20 to 17 for example that same ten thousand um, in value in pigs was all the way down to like 4500 so in essence I didn't lose any money I actually was up by the time this v2 started all I did was just claimed all dogs um, it, it, it roughly left me with like 384 dogs um, that I started out with and then since then I've been able to accumulate roughly about three and a half uh, dog slash BNB LPs um, and two more pigs so um and we've been active for about what three weeks a little less no approximately three weeks to the day so we're 21 days in we started on uh november 1st so i'll show you those visuals i do thank you for rocking with me i don't want to be too long-winded be sure to like and subscribe hit that notification button it helps with the algorithm all right and I do thank you guys once again for tuning in to the Pro Money Geek General. All right, so now we're at the animal farm. So we're going to start from the beginning. So right here, you can see that we're clearly right up under 140 mil TVL. All right, so this one is currently showing at 136. Let's see, let me go back, toggle, let me show. Ah, there we go, that's what I was waiting to see. 139 mil, right up under 140 TVL, BUSD by the way. And here, you can see the pools. So the top pools, the WBNB, BUSD and Ethereum. You can see the APYs on all three, as well as what's locked. Then you got the core firms, the DAW BUSD, the BNB, and the drip BUSD LP. You can see the APYs here, the total value locked here. And then we have the products. You have the pig pen, the piggy bank, and the dog pound. You can see the TVLs here. This is the big chunk right here of what we see up here. So you can see that the pigs are roughly up under 120 per pig. And then the dogs are roughly up under $54. The next category we're gonna go to is the pig pen. So you can see the total stats on the pigs, the ones that's locked, the pigs in the vault, the total value of the pig, what we just saw over here 
in the pig pen. We have the circulating supply of pigs, the total uh, rewards in BUSD that paid out to the pig pen. And then we have the total pigs burned thus far. All right, so you can see I only have 38 pigs. I'm a small fish in a big pond. I'm just starting, so here we go. You can see I've accumulated roughly $10.57 so far today um, in rewards. You can see my pigs that I'm able to withdraw today. All right, and that's it for here. Then we can move over to the dog pound. Dog pound, you can see what I have staked total. I only have four stakes, but if you go up, you can see my total lot is 384 dogs, and I'm roughly able to claim 0.1 pigs so far. I've only claimed 0.43 uh, pigs and put them in the piggy bank or the pig pen so far. All right, and then we're gonna go to the bottom. So far with my dogs, I've been able to accumulate 3.55 uh, dog BNB LPs since staking them on the first at launch on November 1st. All right, so you can see that as well. And you can see the amount of days that I've had them. And you can see I've only added this 0 0.02 dogs um, recently, two days ago or so, because I seen it was just sitting in my wallet. All right, so you can see that as well. And then we're going to move over to the farm. The only thing I have in the farm so far is this drip BUSD. I only have 8.4 of those. And I've only accumulated 0 0.01 dogs so far. Like I keep saying, humble beginnings, rich endings. So I don't have a whole lot of capital to put in yet. But I'll be dca and in throughout the year to help multiply my efforts all right so you can see that this ui is going to be updated soon um if you want to look uh, add liquidity to pigs or dogs so you can put them into the pig pen or um if you want to do dogs for the dog lps to create pigs of course you could do that here if you're looking to swap uh busd for pigs or busd for dogs you do it there of course the drip garden this is here you can see the amount of total lps locked 331,000 um, you can see my position i only have a roughly right up under 2.3 mil um, i've only accumulated 0.2 lps um, since i just last planted my seeds a few moments ago so you can see those all right so that's it with the animal farm then we're going to move over to drip drip you can see in the reservoir that's the first thing i have pulled up so I put in 0.1 BNB. That was recommended when you start in any position in drip. You want to maintain the floor, the floor pricing best you can. So start off with 0.1 BNB and then add on as you go, as you grow your bag. All right. So here, my faucet so far, um, I only have I'm 1,359 drip. Um, you can see how many is claimed. And you can see the max payout, a little under 5000 so far. I only have two people that I invited in um, in this short time. So hopefully I'm going to grow the squad uh, faster than slower. You know, the drip squad, we here now. You, you're going to hear the music. You're going to see the merch. You're going to see the recommendations. Keep in mind, I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. You use your own risk capital make sure that your risk tolerance is measurable to you and what you can tolerate all right me i made a mistake early on and over calculated you know and over leveraged the money that i had but i see a good play so um because i still have money coming in in real life i just took that l for short term that delayed gratification and i I overextended myself in positions that uh, I believe are going to pay heavy dividends at the end of the day. You make that decision for yourself. All right. So that's all I wanted to say. Um, I don't really have a whole lot. Oh, I do want to show you this. See the drip garden. You can see pretty much it's worth 159. I started out with 300, but it's been uh, the decay has been crazy. So 
I roughly have 34 LPs value wise that 2.2 million plants so far if you look at my daily returns it's only five dollars thirty cents and 1.1 LP that I'm creating a day so far so of course I'm gonna be um, I'll be DCA and in to this position and try to grow it faster of course so this is the calculator you want to use you can see the drip pricing here and we're gonna go it's all the way down to 147 a drip and then you can see the BNB &B price is down oh now this is a good time if you're a team builder B reap get that $52.60 get three of them so you can at least have your referral plus whoever they refer so you don't have any problems with that aspect either oh and then you can see here you can see the wallet integrity and then my wallet strength I know people say it don't matter but I like to keep it above water if possible all right so you can see all the things that I was showing before and then you can see the milestones so right here you can see I'm close to 1400 I should reach about the 25th the day after Thanksgiving and then I'll be on to the 1500 you can see how long it's going to take to get to max wallet roughly 326 days so it's only 365 days in a year so less than a year I'll reach my max wallet and after that I reached my 100,000 withdrawal in 583 days. That's why I like this calculator. It's very helpful visually. All right. So, and then, of course, the piggy bank. You want to come to the piggy bank. You can see, like I said, the total piglets amount, the value in those piglets, the total truffle amount that I've accumulated thus far. And then you can see maximum payout. So far, it's only $2,700. Um, but I have a three year lock so 156 weeks so far six months 25 days since the lock um, you can see when it's going to unlock may 8th 2025 and then you can see the awards the percentage awarded so far then you can see my 24 hour bonus here so that's just for you guys if you're looking to learn how to keep up with your position to see it analytically you know that's how you do it all right and then lastly is the pig pen of course what i just showed you on the animal farm um, per pig is right up under 120. this drip pricing is lagging because obviously it's 147 we just saw that then the bnb &B. you can see my rewards here my pig stake is that 38 you can see the value of it right here i only have one percent of the contract share with my 38 pigs so far I have to grow that obviously so that's all um, i thank you guys for staying with me all the way to the end of this video you have been rocking with the pro money geek general himself mr mills and this is the drip squad be sure to tune in again and um, hit that notification button like and subscribe because that's what the algorithm likes so this video can get recommended to other people that's looking for DeFi or other crypto projects that they should be looking into all right peace